Hello and welcome back. So last time this is where we left off with our uh, start for the top bar here. In this one we want to finish up this top bar. That is basically add some padding uh, and make this look like we have it on our design here. Alright, so just gonna close that out. And I, uh, the first thing I want to do is uh, pad this a bit. So just gonna add some padding here. And uh, I'll do left and I'll do 12 and then top I'll do 0 uh, right I will do yep I'll do 12 and bottom I'll do 0 as well now for the text uh, I will do edge align and I'll align this to the center I will V align this which is vertical alignment to the middle all right and then I'm going to add padding here as well so left and right I'm going to say left and right make it 24 top and bottom uh, let's just do something like four all right and then what I noticed is uh, this is actually pretty small so I'm gonna do 128 for the height and then we're going to have to resize the box again but for now uh, let's drag this in and this is what we have all right so our logo is looking uh, better and better so what I'm gonna do now is reduce the size of this obviously all right but as far as padding goes I think we have it all right so just gonna close out of that and what I'm gonna do now is uh, the height is 128 but the height of this box we don't want it to be 128 so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to give it an enforced size so the height is going to be uh, we're gonna go with 54 all right and uh, with that I think we have it so actually let's let's add the font size and this is going to be icons 24 actually let's do 32 and run this again drag it in all right mm. Maybe a little bit too big, yeah. Uh, resize. Hmm. You know what? Uh, no, it's too big. I'm gonna do 24. Alright, let's do 24 and see what we have. Alright, lovely. I love 24. So search by product name or code. Everything is looking uh, pretty good if I say so myself all right so for that one we are done with this part of the uh, the POS screen all right and uh, believe it or not this is exactly where we're going to stop for this one in the next one we are going to add we're going to start adding the thing the the table here but before I go I actually want to pad this to the right just a bit all right, so I'm going to do just that. So I'm actually going to pad the whole thing. All right, so here I'm going to do padding. And left, right, I'm going to do 14. Top and bottom, I'm just going to leave it at zero. All right, run this. Let's see what we have. All right that looks much better if I say so myself all right so this is where we're going to stop for this one in the next one we are going to like I said start adding the table so if you have any questions whatsoever regarding this part of the tutorial make sure to leave them in the comment section otherwise as always thanks for watching thanks for the support thanks for the subscriptions if you haven't already please hit the subscribe button otherwise as always I'll see you in the next one